Hello guys, my name is Ante Jaramillo. I'm a graphic artist and today I'm going to show you how to recreate a grid in Illustrator and for this uh, for this video we're going to use this graphic and we're going to repeat it uh, 16 times total to create a grid of 4x4 so let's get started and actually before I even start I'm going to tell you, uh, tell you that I'm going to use two different ways to do it and the first one we're going to be using the transform tool so if we go to uh, once we have or I have deleted everything, I'm going to go to the effect panel, go to the store and transform, select transform, and I'm actually going to set the horizontal, we have to go to the uh, move section, and I'm going to set my horizontal to be 2.5 inches, uh, and it'll give a half an inch gap between the graphics because the graphic itself is 2 and a half, two by 2. So let's preview, let's select three copies. And that's it. Now we're going to go to the effect panel again, select transform, and we're going to apply an effect. We're going to zero out the horizontal and give it a two and a half inch uh, space to the vertical. Three copies, and that's it. Now we go to our layer, um, layer panel. We're going to notice it's still just one single image so if we need uh, to select images independently we're going to go to the object menu and click on expand expand appearance ungroup twice just by clicking shift command g and that gives us independent uh, or use of the graphics in graphics independently now we want to do this manually let me just delete everything and then create random copies let me just copy these four times. So what we can do now is we're going to use the uh, align panel. So by selecting the four graphics, the top four graphics, we're going to go to, uh, if you don't see the align to or distribute spacing options, you just go to um, the right top corner of the panel, select that icon, and select the, uh, select show options. So now that we have the align to and distribute spacing options, we're going to click on align to. Select to uh, select align to key object, and to select our key object, which would be the one on the left, you just click it one more time, and if you apply some in, you will notice that it just has a heavier line, and that's how you can tell the uh, regular objects from the key object. So once we have that, we're going to uh, click on vertical line center, and then we're gonna select uh, our gap to be half an inch. And we're going to click on horizontal distribute space and that's it now we're going to go to our left uh, column to um, fix the ones on the left so that we can fix the rest of the graphics and same thing same process align to key object so now we're going to click uh, horizontal line center and leaving that half an inch we're going to click on vertical distribute space make sure that you select your key object and that's it so now if we select the the, uh, the rest of the column uh, rows, we can just follow the same process, always making sure that you select your key object. And that's the last one. So line two, line two key object. Make sure I select my key object. Vertical align center. And then horizontal distribute space. Well, that's it, guys. That's how we, uh, that's how we can set up a grid using our um, transform option, or by just manually uh, creating copies and using the align panel, distributing them, and aligning them. So, thank you for watching, guys.